Here it is, folks, the weird guitar of the day. 1998 Music Box Space Ranger in school bus yellow. Now, I don't think they made too many of these. It's a kind of a fun little guitar. It's got two mini humbucking pickups. It's kind of got a distorted telecaster shape. Tis a bolt on, the fourth bolt neck in the back, and the typical stop tailpiece bridge there. Um, the headstock is unique. Take a look at that. These wild string trees there, and it says right on it, Space Ranger and Music Box. I got it back in 1998. I believe, if I remember, I saw them at a guitar show, and I thought, oh, that's really something. And I got this one, and I like the school bus yellow color, because it was kind of unique. And it's a neat little guitar. It's got some pros and cons, but I don't think they're making this anymore. Um, I see the value has gone up. I paid around $230, I think, for it new. It came with a neat gig bag, which I still have. It says Music Box right on it. Uh, it's got some fun features. It's a short scale, so if you have bigger hands, it's a little, it's a little tight fit for me. Um, this headstock is just a little big too, being that the size that it is, you got to watch that you don't bump into things. I played it out a few times years ago, and then I decided I was just going to keep it pristine because it's such an odd bird. It's got the Telecaster looking knobs on it. Three-way position switch. Here's the front pickup, or the neck pickup. Here is the trebly pickup in the back. The bridge pickup. It's brighter, but not overly bright. These uh, mini humbuckers are punchy without being a lot of, you know, an overdriven sound. And here is both of them on the middle position on the switch. It's an interesting guitar. The headstock is a little unwieldy there. But you know you have to get used to reaching around it. It's got two offset string trees there. Of course, it's got a truss rod. There you go. Take it in. There it is. There you can see it a little bit better there. And of course, I had to get a matching yellow cord. And I'm wearing this sort of yellow last clean shirt from the '80s to pull the whole thing together here. But um, it's not a bad little guitar. It's a novelty kind of guitar. I don't think they even make the Space Ranger anymore. I checked their website today. They're making a lot of basses and custom guitars. They seem to opt for, in the 2000s, a lot of flashier finishes, and which um, I kind of like the school bus yellow color. It's very interesting. Nice neck on it. The neck is good. It was, I believe it was made in Korea, if I remember, uh, at the time when a lot of the Epiphones were being made there. <laughs> See, it stays in tune nice. You can hear the intonations nice. So there it is. The Space Ranger by Music Box. You don't see these every day, I'll tell you. And it's good for a lot of different types of music. I really like this front pickup. I... I thought when I first saw it, you know, it's maybe it's a combination of a telly and a firebird, but it's not. It's its own thing. I'm thinking these really are, I've never opened it up and I can't find a lot of information on it, but I'm pretty sure these are the two uh, double coils with the uh, wire bobbins around it in there and not a rail. I think it's actually a coil, so mini humbuckers. Gotta love it. Nice. Sounds good.
find one. They're not for everybody. Music Vox Space Ranger, dated from 1998. There you go.